So I got some bad news. I messed my hand up a little bit, but the good news is I'm not going to let this stop me from recording today's episode. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another day in the HTB career streets, man. We're jumping into episode number 26. Absolutely nuts how much love you guys have been showing, but um, yeah, my hand's not in the best condition. It is a bit swollen, should hopefully be good in a couple days, but this is essentially going to be the flu game of the 2k streets man i'm gonna be at a disadvantage and playing on a hall of fame difficulty but honestly i'm not too worried because when it comes to dribbling and moving around i use my left hand a little bit more pause on that but yeah man basically to cap off the last episode not only did we go crazy on the orlando magic but Where's my cigar? Because we lit up that Othella pack and we smoked that man out of here. He resigned, AKA, we got that man fired. And now in our series here, we gotta go check up with Freddy Novak and see what he's doing in my crib. Now y'all see, I got cleaned up. I'm no longer the depressed, all black HTB. I got the glasses, Jordans. Look at how I'm color matching, man. I low key got some serious drip. Y'all let me know in the comments, rate the fit out of 10, but let me just make sure we've got no upgrades that we need so we earned no badges in the last episode we can't do any upgrades so yeah everything is what it is now of course if you guys are new to the channel please consider hitting that subscribe button man 75 percent of you guys still are not subscribed but are watching my videos it helps me a ton when you hit sub and it doesn't really take much time out of your day so that'd be great man but appreciate the love that y'all continue to show nonetheless let's see what the boy freddy is up to so freddy what do you think? I mean, yeah. it's not bad, huh? It's really impressive. The Thank space, you. the people, the map. <laughs> hey, man, you told us to win over the city, so this is us winning it. Big mm -hmm. moves require bold action. Come on. Tactical maneuvers, military mm -hmm. precision. Mm -hmm. No, what did I tell you about those war analogies? I mean, yeah, it makes me seem not genuine, you. but it's OK. Is I mean, it? We all know Ricky's heart's in the right place. Yeah, see? But he doesn't know. You guys are a who. <laughs> we try, man. I mean, we try to keep the comedy flowing around. Imagine here. Freddy's the villain this whole yeah, time. I'll be that. so I stunned. I hate to be a bummer, but I and bring up something potentially uncomfortable. But I think we need to talk about Othella. Light me that it's pack, all yeah. It's all part of the game. Talk to you, man. Oh, how imagine if Freddie just now, I want whipped out a pack of cigars. All are Light me up. Turn the music on. The way things played out with Othella. I mean, Othella made his own decisions. It's not the team's fault. Right. Well, that being said, Ashley and I. I've been working on a really exciting opportunity. Consider it a little thank you from the organization. <clears throat> and for being from a Ashley, Hooper? Of course. <clears throat> I'm telling y'all, Ashley hey, you guys loves have been me. really man. doing your thing on the PR strategy, so I'm all ears. Talk to me. Have you heard of Enterprise Monthly? <laughs> yes. I mean, mm -hmm. they do all of this. What? World's richest teenager, 30, 30 disruptors under 30. 30. Yeah. Right. And once a year, they do an issue on leadership where they crown the next big thing in a variety of industries. Okay. Uh, finance, of course, law, politics, science, and maybe even sports. I went to school with the editor in chief, and I've been in his ear about how you're creating a whole new paradigm for the athlete slash businessman. That right. could open up a whole other world of business opportunities mm -hmm. for us. And help Mila us. Mila is using me for money. I know it. Once and for all, mm. put the media focus where it belongs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's on your considerable achievements. Listen, that sounds awesome. Mm-hmm. I'll schedule a time for you to meet one of their reporters, Anna Nunez. Mm-hmm. Uh, she's going to see if you're a good fit because this is their best-selling issue, and they make a huge deal out of it. So Amazing. if she's into your story, she'll be filming it. She'll be putting video segments online. The works. This, is, this, is, this sounds pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> Ashley, Freddie, I, I can't thank you guys enough for setting this up. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get down to work. Literally what you pay us for. Get yes, busy, baby. We're those. still not done running the city, though. There's a couple more flags we got to put down. Why do we have all of them as MP? Nothing. It's all good. Cool. Well, now that that is settled, can we please put the piece on the map? Mm hmm Dear Right God. now? Yes! yes. Um, I'm sorry, what is happening? No, all right, Freddie, check this out. We have this tradition with the map oh, where we God, mark the territory that we've won. And since MP has just established himself as the future of this franchise, <laughs> Freddy. Oh, oh. Come on, man. Don't say no. You got the honors, oh man. My come God. on, no, come no, on. No, I couldn't. Come I, on. Yeah. I should Fred. Okay. Slam it. Slam it. Slam it. Slam it. Slam it. Slam it. Pause. 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 Oh. Hey. Yes. No, Mila, that was a bad That's one. it? Well, I didn't I don't want to break anything. I got caught up in the moment. Come on, Freddy. You, you guys, great. you're really something. Yes. You know that? This reporter is gonna have one heck of a story on her hands. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. And next time I'm gonna 
I'll do it. I'm gonna go all the way with Yeah, it. I just didn't want to break anything. So Yo, next I like time that I'm pink hoodie it. a lot. He's always wearing something nice. All right, man. So now we're heading over to the arena and we're playing our next game. I quickly want to double check on my quests. We're getting that much closer to being able to influence trades in free agency. That's going to be a lot of power in my hands. Can't wait for that. But more importantly, the Zion one becoming an on court coach. So we got eight more to go, which is going to translate to about four more NBA games that we got to finish. And we'll be able to call ISOs and different plays for our team. I'll be able to get some nasty buckets that way, but yeah, man, it should be a good time. Here I am entering the locker room with my boy Siakam. He's literally walking in slow motion. What the heck? But y'all see on the bottom left, we have a back-to-back -back game against the Orlando Magic. Every time I have played them, I have absolutely decimated them. And this works out perfectly to gassing up the HTB flu game. Yes, I know it's my hand, but I don't know what else to call it that'll sound cool. So we're calling it the HTB flu game. Now, something y'all have been missing is the goggles. I simply got to go ahead and bring those back. They don't look good comboed with a headband, so I'm going to take it easy. We're going to take those off. And as far as the shoes for today, man, what do I want to remember as the HTB flu game shoes, man. This is a very big decision to make. I low-key feel like I gotta go with the Kobe's or even the Kyrie's. I gotta add some new shoes to my collection. Now nah, we're going with the Paul George's, man. I love these, these are so tough. Yeah, we're locked. All right, ladies and gentlemen of the YouTube world, welcome to the back-to-back -back against the Orlando Magic. And honestly, I'm on good vibes, man. Our whole team is healthy. Van Vliet's been hitting shots. I mean, it's hard to get mad about anything. And again, that Othello pack is hitting like that alley-oop to warm the game up. I'm definitely not sure how many shots I'll take this game. It depends on how many are dropping. If I could still shoot comfortably with this thing in my hand, we're going to be all right. Paolo calling an ISO on Scotty Barnes is so disrespectful. I mean, what is that shot selection? Look at me hustling for rebounds, man. It's all about doing it all. Give me that screen. Oh, yeah, stopping. Goggles HTB. He's back. He's back. Look at how I'm doing this. <laughs> What's wrong with me, man? Shooting really isn't that hard. It's more the dribbling. Still got that behind the back. Give me in the post. Oh, yeah. Kobe-esque. We don't miss those. Come on, man. You thought this was going to stop me? Y'all are about to see the craziest flu game of all time. Thank goodness it's against the Magic. Good defense. We there, we there, we there. Good defense by Siakam. Oh, yeah, we're getting up the court. Scotty. Oh, you're running too fast. Hit me with a screen. Hey, Siakam. Needle threader. Hey! There's that leadership bonus off the bat. Yo, ever since I got that special delivery, it's been so easy to throw alley-oops. I'm there for the help. I'm there for the help. You're not shooting that. Not with confidence, Jalen. Yeah, he's missing that. One thing I do wish we had was Christian Coloco still on this team because we really need a solid big man. Rebounding is so tough. Oh, take that all the way. Hey! That's without the posterizer badge or the dunk stick. We just victimized Franz Wagner. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Goggles HTB is literally different. He's just a different kind of dog, man. I'm in a rhythm and we've already got double takeover. Now, one thing I do want to do is change my shot creating one back to slasher because now that I actually have posterizing dunks, it could end up being beautiful. Look at this defense, bro. Hands up. Oh, no, 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 no. Good defense. Thank you for that help, Siakam. Every time I have shot creating takeover, I take such dumb shots. Gotta go for it. Come on. We greet the leaner. Ow. Ah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. We greet the leaner. We greet the leaner. I stretched my arm out a little too much there. That kind of hurt. Nice rebound there. Come on. Ball don't lie. He missed. I'm stopping. I'm popping. Bang. Yo, how am I missing that in transition? Look at Jalen Suggs making his best Antarctica role play. Man is as cold as they come. I've been missing more than I'd like to. Come on. Stop missing, HTB. Ah, see, my shooting, it's getting a little difficult here. Bro, everybody is just attacking me on offense. And honestly, that's fine because I'm still clamping. But the thing about shooters is they stay shooting no matter the situation. Come on, man. I just got to adjust a little bit, but we fine. We're already up 20 to 8. Domination. Someone in the crowd just called me soft. Bet on that. Cross that over. Yes, sir. I'll show you soft. Pause on that. Siakam. Dime him. Dime him. Show him how we get it done out here, man. Yo, I really got chemistry with my team now. The amount of ISOs that Paolo has tried to call on our team, and it just hasn't worked, as you guys can see there, is hilarious. 
The Orlando Magic really are a bad team, but Wendell Carter Jr. shutting me up super quickly there. Now, my offensive game hasn't exactly been the prettiest tonight, but that doesn't mean we give up, man. I can make impact on the offensive end instead of just scoring. I can pass that rock and especially throw those alley-oops. They're so consistent now. One thing I really got to do is wake up offensively all the way through. Hey, I'm just going to get to the basket. If I can't shoot consistently, I'll find other ways to make an impact here. Throw that. Good defense. That's what I love about team takeover. Being able to control the players. Let me get right back to them. Chris Boucher, I'm going to need your services on this beautiful pick and pop. Come on. You got me. Pop in. Ow! Yo, his jumper is so nice for a big man. It's honestly crazy. They can't hit any shots right now. Go right back to HTB. I got the double takeover, but you know what? I want to go down the middle. To Boucher, that is. Dimers! Bang! I completely forgot Gary Harris is on the Magic. Good defense, though. Go Bro, Boucher is looking like an MVP player right now. I'm loving what I'm seeing from him. Hey, Siaka, let's go right to that pick and roll. You got to hit that screen faster. Thank you all the way through. Hey! No and one, but... We got some free throws. Already up 23 points here in the first half. We're getting spoiled by playing this team because I know next time we're probably going to be playing like the Celtics or something and it's going to be such a wake-up call. Second free throw there is going to fall. They got me at point guard. I love this, being able to play call. See, I can't wait till I can always do this because look, right down the middle, man. Get me in the post. Yes, sir. Kobe-esque. I'm not missing those ever. Ever, because you get a really nice push off them when you use that momentum and you're so open. Calling for an ISO, Gary. Get out of the way, my brother. I see that lane down the middle. I gotta take it all the way through. Drawing the foul. Can't get any and one animations today, but hey man, I like the free throws. These only warm me up for when I gotta eventually take that jumper. For those of you guys that are grinding out your my career, what point in the season are you guys at? Let me know in the comments. All right, man, we're officially jumping into the second half. That first half wasn't exactly my greatest in terms of percentages. We went four for 10 from three, which is still 40%, but still not good in my eyes. Oh, get that inside to Siakam. Yes, sir, get the boy eating. There's the end one we've been looking for, man. Let's use that momentum. Look at that, the Paolo Boncaro ISO. It literally never works. Get the ball up the court. I'm looking to get trigger happy. This is the flu game. So even if it's bad percentages, I can just say it was the flu game. All the way through. Yay! And it's just more and more free throws. Can you just let me dunk, Wendell? Y'all are down damn near 30 points. Take it easy, my brother. Loosen that headband. Take off your goggles and take a breather. Second free throw here. Yo, yo my shooting is so bad today. I'm sorry, y'all. OG, I need some floor spacing. Snatch back. That's way too open. I got to take that, right? Finally, something drops. That is so nice to see, man. I'm actually stunned that they literally run the Paolo Boncaro ISO for all 48 minutes tonight. Oh, almost got a turnover there. Let me be careful. OG, run that pick and roll with me, baby. Get that pass inside. Hey, get her done. Yeah, coach, you can go ahead and sit me for the rest of the evening because I will offer not much more production after this. Can we just go ahead and win this game? Oh, they're bringing me back in the fourth quarter. That's surprising. Might as well continue to put on a show. I want to silence this crowd. For a team that's down 23, that crowd is making a lot of noise. Let me go ahead and let me silence them. Cross. Yeah, the signature. Come on. Too much space there. Easy greens. And just like that, it's quiet. I can hear a fart at the top row, bro. Huh? Yeah, so as you guys can see, I got a little too trigger happy and now my guy is cold. Let me see if I can backdoor cut that. Thank you. Hey, okay, we got a bucket. Got to rely on the team to get me open. Let me give it to Scotty Barnes. Immediately cut to the basket because Wendell Carter is too slow, bro. The give and goes right now are filthy. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. Give and go offense is doing its thing and this man simply can't guard me. Nice pass again and I'm just going to keep cutting to the basket. I didn't know how much of a meta that was. I'm cheesing the computer right now. Why is Wendell Carter bullying me? Just because I got nicer goggles than you doesn't mean you have to post me up. You know what? Give me the ball, bro. Give me the ball. Where's Wendell Carter Jr.? I want to be switched on to him. You think I'm just going to let you get away with that? Nah, let me switch on to him. There we go. All right, now we're good. Now we're good. Let me show you how we get it done, my brother. Yeah, you're going to need to send the double teams. That's what I thought. Give me the ball back. I'm not done. Bro, chill. Chill out. 
I'm getting benched for the rest of the game. I couldn't get my one last revenge bucket on Wendell, bro. The Magic kept double teaming. They're like, nah, this man's not gonna end up on a hoop mixtape. It's just not happening. But it looks like the final score, 106 to 86, man. That's another dub in the books for our team. Hey, I'm happy. 46 points there, nine assists as you guys saw, but we also shot 35% from the three point line. That's what's gonna happen when you got something like this in your hand. Of course, I gotta show you guys it was indeed on that Hall of Fame difficulty. Did not stop me from getting things done. Playmaking badge has been unlocked. Just got a call from Phil Boyer's assistant. Phil's gonna meet you in Coach Graves' office before your next game, wants to talk some things over, probably wants to apologize TBH. Hey. It's apologize. This apology, sorry, it's about to hit. No, so just okay. Just lay it out, I, I'll, I'll, yeah, uh, yeah. Do you want to sit down? Uh, no, you stay. You sure? Just sit. should I come back? Okay. No, no, we're good. I, I didn't want to interrupt. MP, this conversation. Have a seat. All right. I was hoping we can talk about how the Othello situation played out. Yeah, I mean it was just business. Tell right? me I was Not right. Not the way man. I do business. Tell you should have heard right. it from me first. Itchy Twitter fingers. Yes. That was unfortunate, but I wanted to let you know you have the full support of the organization. You're the future of this team, MP, and one of its unquestioned leaders. Gas me uh, up, gas me up. That really means a lot to hear you say that, sir, truly. Glad to hear it. Uh, well, I've got to be elsewhere. Um, There's no watch on his wrist. proud of how you handled the situation, MP. Wow, well you're done. a phony. You. You're a phony. You were Thanks, looking Phil. at a fake watch. I'm, I'm low-key offended. Not the most friendliest guy, huh? A little cold, but he's good people. Hey, hey, I got nothing against him, man. <laughs> so what happens next? Y'all gonna throw me a parade? I'm curious what happens like now. Up or something? <laughs> Hilarious. What happens next is you're gonna work harder than you've ever worked before. That's always the goal, coach. Good, good. And we're gonna do everything we can to get you there. Moving forward, I'm gonna be giving you very specific goals. I feel like so we're about to, to unlock the influencing free agency me, okay? here. Okay. So this is gonna be a big deal. Where am deal. I going? <laughs> I'm just saying. The work's just starting. All right. I got you, coach. Don't even worry about it. And y'all can see on the bottom left, the quest has officially been complete. So what is next as far as the main things go? So there is the college flashbacks, which I heard some of you guys mention in the comment section. But I think what we're going to try to get into now is finishing off this whole Hammond Park because... We're trying to take over the whole city, and it looks like the last thing we gotta do is meet with Ricky and Ashley at Uncle Bobby's charity event at Robert Miles Pack, but I think we're probably gonna end up saving that for the next episode. Nick Nurse, good coaching as always. Pascal Siakam, GG's men, our team went out there and we hooped. I do wanna take a quick look at our schedule here, and it looks like we play the Sacramento Kings. That should honestly be pretty sweet. The Brooklyn Nets, and then Golden State, and then Philly. That three game stretch is going to be painful. The Nets cooked us last time. Kevin Durant, when he's angry, is not a fun person to play. And I'm yet to run into Steph Curry, Clay, Draymond, Jordan Poole. So that's going to be a whole other mission on its own. That's a very good defensive team. And y'all can see we're currently third in the Eastern Conference. We're 18 and 9. So even though things weren't looking the greatest earlier on, we've made things happen. Othello's gone. We're winning games. No one's injured. It's good vibes. But with that being said, man, I'm going to catch y'all in episode 27. Peace.